This coming fall, join Heritage Place in Oklahoma City for their annual quarter horse yearling sale. The industry's largest sale event is scheduled to begin at 10 a.m. on Thursday, September 15th. So mark your calendar and make your plans now to be in Oklahoma City. This three-day offering will consist of nearly 1,000 head of the finest quarter horse yearlings presented at auction anywhere this year in the country. We invite you to join us, Heritage Place, where champions are sold. Gino broke in at the start, bumped into Lano Teller, who got away fast. Far side, JLS, Mr. Big Time came away fast as well. Cold Cash, one, two, three, goes with them. Down at the rail, Bodacious Dash, trying to come on his first down master and DM streaking through fire. Cold Cash, one, two, three, DM streaking through fire. JLS, Mr. Big Time, Bodacious Dash at the rail. Three of them gonna hit the line together. Far side, Cold Cash, one, two, three, at the rail, Bodacious Dash, and DM streaking through fire in a barn birder in the Rainbow Derby. The photo showed Cold Cash 123 just in front of Bodacious Dash with DM streaking through fire and nose back in third. JLS Mr. Big Time checked in fourth. Cold Cash 123 runs his 440 yard record to five for five and adds $449,000 to his account. Trainer Sleepy Gilbreth added to his own record with a seventh Rainbow Derby victory. Jockey Roy Baldiez picked up his second. He and Gilbreth previously teamed up to win with the Great Mare's significant speed 11 years ago. Roy Baldiez has just survived a very close photo to win the Rainbow Derby. Did you know you won it? Uh, yes, I did. <laughs> yes, he, uh, those horses were there early in the race, and, uh, and uh, uh, probably the last 100 yards he started creeping up on them and, and got by them. Uh, I, knew I'd got, I knew I'd got him. Cold Cash 123 lived up to his name as the 2 to 1 Rainbow Derby favorite. He combined with third choice Bodacious Dash for a generous $2 exacta payoff of $40.40. The winner is a gelding by Oak Tree Special out of Hot Cash 123. He was bred by his owners, Walter and Carolyn Bay from Michigan, who race as the T Bill Stables. Well, it's not too often that we get quarter horse owners from Michigan coming to win a grade one in Ruidoso. That's true. Right. It was worth the trip. It was worth the trip. Oh, and I hope Michigan understands that we're proud of Michigan. <laughs> well, and it, hopefully this will be encouragement for somebody up there to buy a good horse. Huh? Right, exactly. <laughs> we we had ahead. talked last night about Cole Cash, about his ability, but his need to get away from the gate. Were you yeah. satisfied with what you saw today? Yes, we were today. Oh. It was a little bit uh, uh, hard on the nerves, that uh, last uh, 50 yards, but uh, he got away real well and uh, that was the key. Here's the complete order of finish. Bodacious Dash picks up nearly $144,000 while DM Streaking Through Fire added almost $72,000. Rudosa Derby winner Lano Teller finished seventh and Georgina was last after acting up in the paddock following saddling. Be sure to check back tomorrow for an expanded recap of the $900,000 Rainbow Derby. JEH Stallion Station has a remarkable sire selection standing at stud that will add speed to any program. JEH is well known for producing winners of numerous major stakes races time and again with the likes of Trace Sace, A Political Jess, and New Mexico bred Brook Stone Bay in the genetic offering. Why not explore your options with us? Endless possibilities with winning results. JEH Stallion Station. Travel accommodations provided by La Quinta in Ruidoso, the horseman's home away from home.